Hey guys, Silver Flash here. So I hope everyone's staying warm as the winter storms are spreading across the state here in the latter part of February. They even had to come down here to Texas today and give us a little bit of snow. So I got a box in from Provident Metals. As we know, the mail service even runs during the bad times. So let me go ahead and get this open. This was my first order doing a um, e-check and it actually took about a week for it to even process so that was kind of interesting. I placed this order on the 12th and as of the filming it's the 23rd today so like I said it took about a week to process the e-check. I seen that um, Provident does that. I don't know about every place but I know Provident does it now and it's actually a pretty good deal as it's a lot harder to send off a check than it is just to enter your um, bank account information so that was my first experience with that let me get this camera positioned correctly take out this smaller box inside of this bigger box. They also gave me some nice paper, packing paper with it. So let's go ahead and get this box opened up. Providence did a pretty good job with their packing as you can see most of their boxes are inside of boxes with packages so they do a really good job of getting all this stuff packaged up pretty good I got a wide variety of stuff here let's get some more of the stuff out of the way I'll probably do a, another video showing some close-ups of this is I'm not gonna be able to get my camera to focus close enough to really show some good detail on this. Let's go ahead and open up the first one. I probably know what's inside this one. Yep, this would be my first proof Zomba Silver. Okay, that's it for that box or package I'll show more of this in my close-up but just do a quick quick run through of each one there you see the proof Zombuck feast dollar or yeah this is the feast dollar 259 so got that Really cool looking. Okay, we'll go ahead and get this second one opened up. And some Canadian coinage. What year did we get here? 1965, pretty cool. All right, Ooh. picking this up, I already know what's in here. This is my free shipping item. All right, there we go. The copper crackers so this is actually let's see here 16 one ounce bars of copper really cool I think shipping for this order was going to be about ten dollars and these were about two dollars so kind of 
cool to pick them up because I got them for a pretty decent deal and they're really cool looking. Okay, so let's get on to this one. Ooh, here's the most of the order. Alright, that's it. Let's get some of this out of the way. Alright. We've got a dollar of silver here. So, or, yeah, a dollar of silver coinage. We have the new Don't Tread on Me bar. Really cool. We have a Uno Peso, I think it is, 1943. Really cool. We have the new Symphonian Birds round from Provident. And Augustian Staples. Here we got the Goat Privy. Here is a Mexican Olympic. Here you see another Augustian Staples. Here is the new Canadian um, Hawk. Here we see a dollar worth of 40%. Kennedy Halves. Here is Another Mexican coin, the Cinco Peso. Really cool and big. Here, here's another uh, Prospector. And let's get to the last one. Okay, so just some air tights in here. But like I said, I'll probably break this out into more separate videos. So let's just do a quick overview of everything I got and then I'll do some separate videos on these kind of bunched up together. So we got the Proof Zombux. Really nice. We have the Copper Crackers. Real nice and heavy. The Um, 80% silver Canadian mint set. This one from 65. We got the Prospector. Some of the Mexican coins. The 5th and 6th Hercules, a couple dollars. And Constitutional Silver, the Don't Tread on Me bar. The new um, Red Tail Hawk. Some more of the Mexican silver. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this. As always guys, please like, favor, and subscribe. And keep stacking and collecting.